All right, 520, let's head over to Matt over in the Weather Center. Check out that forecast, and I hear rumors of a cool down in the long range forecast. We do have double digit highs in the seven day forecast, and even next week, we do have a couple of 80 degree days. Oh. Yeah, believe that or not. I mean, it's going to feel great to finally get a cool down after the triple digits. Right now, our downtown summer on the camera looking closer to the resort corridor looking okay this morning. I know it is going to be a pretty quiet and cooler start out there for some of us, but still around 84 degrees in Las Vegas, North Las Vegas at 83. We're looking at some calm wind outside and 10 mile per hour wind speed in Henderson. Right now, temperatures out the door. I know we're at 79 degrees in Ellis Air Force Base, 83 in North Las Vegas and 72 in Peram. Your day planner, we are looking at the sunshine, but adding some of that haze to the sky and the line fire has now grown up to nearly 26,000 acres. It's 5% contained. That smoke near LA is gonna be pushing into Las Vegas and the valley heading throughout the day today and tomorrow. And it's really going to be leaving us with some impactful air quality. Right now we're between good to moderate, not too bad outside, but temperatures this afternoon around 103 degrees. We will add a little bit of a breeze today, but the strongest wind lining up for tomorrow. Here's Wednesday, a red flag warning, which means we have an increased fire weather concerns outside, low relative humidities, really dry air in place with wind gusts around 30 to 40 miles per hour. So any fires that may ignite or get started could spread pretty quickly on days like tomorrow with the dry weather and also the gusty wind. So I want to show you this. The stretch of some of that smoke right now is lining up from Baker to Barstow all the way up into Pahrump through about 7 o'clock. But by 10 o'clock, we're going to be coated with a lot of smoke across Las Vegas. If you're near Black Mountain or Anthem looking towards the Strip, it's going to be one of those days where you probably can't even see it. So visibilities will definitely be impacted by some of the smoke. And it looks like the thickest smoke is actually going to be right here overnight into the 1 and 2 o'clock hour on your Wednesday. And again, that line fire 5% contained. That's the main thing. And it's grown to about 26,000 acres over the last few days. We'll get some relief into Wednesday. We get that northwest wind shift, which kind of clears us out. So for tomorrow, we'll look generally clear, especially by the end of the day. Uh, but still looking at some impactful air quality over the next 24 hours. Forecast high temperatures 100 degrees tomorrow, so we're still right there in the upper 90s and looking at satellite radar pretty quiet outside. So here you go, your school edition forecast Tuesday morning, 83 degrees. The afternoon pickup around 100. We'll keep it breezy at times, 15 to 20 mile per hour gusts. In the next two weeks in calendar view, we highlight the days in red with the most impactful weather. We're looking at Wednesday and even this Tuesday uh, today with increasing haze and gusty wind outside. Also next Tuesday, the 17th. 80 degree highs in the future. Your first alert forecast breezy Tuesday. We're windy on Wednesday and then we're clear. But look at those temperatures dropping the double digits through the weekend and into next week. We'll be right back after this break.